that you can't rock with me. <laughs> Woo! Hey, you two, what's good with it, man? It's your boy C6 Skills. You know I'm out here on my grind. No grind, no shine. You know the vibes. Look here. Man, it's been about what? Eight months? Yeah, eight months exactly since I cut my dreads. I had dreads for 17 years. You know, go check out the video. Go check out the video. But it's been eight months since I cut the dreads, man. And I figure, you know, it's about time I go ahead and show everybody what products I have used at some point during my journey or I'm still using today. So let's get it. Times are different now that I am older. Care about life now, so no more looking over shoulders. My heart All right, so here we go. Let's get right into it. We ain't gonna waste no more time. I have the products here. I'm gonna show you how I use it. Well, not show you how I use it. I'm gonna tell you how I use it, why I use it as well. So, first things first, let's start off with how I wash my hair, how I keep it clean, how I prepare to keep myself fresh. You know, because you gotta stay on that self care. You feel me? Brothers, you gotta stay on the self care. But first things first, let's go ahead. Man, I like to use a Shea Moisture. Man, I like the smell of it. It's fire, it's bomb. Good smell, it really cleans my hair. It give me that deep cleaning. So I use the Shea Moisture Shampoo. It's official. Bam, smack it down with the uh, conditioner. Keep the conditioner on deck as well. So I normally use this for my washing styles. And then I, I finish it off with this. Go check out my washing style video. I'll show you exactly how I do it. Check that out. Secondly, when I first started my waves, when I first cut my hair down, the very, very, very first thing I used <laughs> was this 360 style. Now, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. This 360 style, I approve. I approve. I approve. I approve. I'm telling you, this right here <laughs> is light. So, unlike the OG Murray's I'm gonna get to, this washes out your hair fairly decently. I mean, you can get it out really, really easily with this. This, I mean, it gives your hair that shine. It holds really well. It's, man, the 360 style right here, love it. Then we got that young OG Murray's. Come on now. Man, look, people was using this back in the day. You smell me? OG Murray's. Now, I only use this typically when I'm woofing, okay? I really use it in my crown area. Tap my crown down a little bit. I really never put it down in this area. I just kind of let the brush bring it down into the rest of my hair. So the OG Murray, solid for the crown. Get it. I mean, if you don't have the OG Murray's, man, I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, it's not a natural product, I get it, but it's still fire and it works. As far as my oils, right now, <laughs> I love that Jamaican black castor oil. This is official. This helps your hair grow. You know, it gives you that great shine. You know, it, it just gives you that nutrients that it needs. You smell me? You smell me? Another oil that I use, this is my everyday, my ritual right here, that vitamin E. That vitamin E oil. <sighs> Fire, real good oil right there. Now, I'm about to show you something real when it comes to the oils. Hey, shout out to my boy, Poppy Blasted, man. It's not really my boy, I don't know you or anything, bro, but I support you and I fool with you, bro. Shout out to my man, Poppy. Hey, he has this legendary oil. Woo-hoo! Listen here. <laughs> I only use this when, I'm, when it's time to step out. But me and wifey about to go ahead and get fresh and go ahead and make a move. I'm using a legendary oil. It smells like fruity pebbles. No cap. No cap. Man, let me get this thing open for you, man. It smells like fruity pebbles. Oh, my God. Every time. Then it comes in. Come on, bro. Poppy snapped. He snapped. This is right here. This is this. I don't use this every day. Can't use this every day. First of all, it costs too much. Secondly, this is for when I'm stepping out. I gotta get fresh to death and do my little one two thing, you know? You feel me? So those are the oils I use right there. That's my oils right there. You feel? Let's go. As far as moisturizers, 
this as I am, the double buttercream, this is pretty solid, okay? But I gotta keep it real with you. The first few times I used this, this made my hair over curl so bad that it took me forever to lay it back down. But now that my waves are more locked in, you know, my pattern is set, everything's rocking and rolling, this works out. It works out now. I, you know, I can use it and I, I know, I understand how to use it better now. So this works out. Another great moisturizer I like to use is that Young Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. I ain't gonna lie to you. I only started using this because I, I see my man 360Gs and he put me up on game. And no lie, it's official. It did make my hair over curl a little bit in the beginning. When before I had my pattern all set in and ready to go. But now it's official, man. I like it. It's great to moisturize, okay? Bam. That's what we got for our moisturizers right there. Now, let's get to the real deal, holy field. This is what I use, okay? This is why when people ask me, they see my ways like, oh, what products are you using, bro? This is it right here, okay? After a wonderful cut, I use this. While I'm wolfing, I use this. Man, that poppy blasted goat drip. Ooh, let me tell you about this right there. Man, fire products. You see here, what I got? What I got here? I got the goat drip moisturizer. I got the Go Drape Pomade. This is from when I'm wolfing. This is what I'm using it right now. I'm using this right now because I'm, I'm I'm in a heavy wolf right now. I'm in like week seven of a 12 week wolf. Week seven of a 12 week wolf. Let's go. And you got the Go Drip Butter. Man, this combination here with the oil. <laughs> hey, that boy probably blasted acting a fool when he made this. No cap. Fire. Like, every single one of them smell bomb. Like, they, man, they all have their own unique smell. But they all smell bomb. Like, like this one here. What is this right here? The moisturizer. Bro, it smells like cupcakes or cake batter or something, bro. Oh, my God, bro. The pomade just... Oh, bro, like it got a little hint of cologne in that thing. Do you smell me? You like breakfast? Bro, this smell like breakfast, bro. I don't know what that boy using in this product, man, but he snapped. That go drip, I use that often, man. I love the go drip. Gotta get the go drip. And that's what we got right there for the products at this moment. That's what I use. These are the products I put in my hair to keep my waves going. These are the products I use. Now, for the brushes I use. <laughs> I got some heat, man. I got some real heat when it comes to the brushes. You feel me? But first things first, I'm going to start off with that comb. If you're not using a comb to get your waves, what are you doing? This is how you stretch it out right here. A lot of times, especially in this area of mine, man, they get all tangled and bunchy. Bam, I stretch it out with the comb. And me, I, I could consistently wolf. For the entire eight months of me having waves, I've been wolfing, non-stop wolfing, okay? So this comb, 
First things first, man, it's great to stretch out your waist. You gotta use the comb. So this is the comb I use right here. Bam. Next thing, X thing I use, here goes my wash brush. This right here, you can get this one nice and wet. There's no worry, it's made for that. This is my wash brush I use right here. Amazing brush, nice firm. This is what I use. It's a little wet right now because I just got done with a washer style not too long ago. <laughs> Did a washer style not too long ago. And then my other detangler. Oh, I love this little baby right here, man. This detangler right here, man. It stretch your waves out really, really good. Get all the little kinks out. It gets down to your scalp and it just gets that new growth and it just gets it flowing and trains it to go in the direction you want it to go. So that's what I use for my wash. Right here. It's my wash brushes. Wash brush, and my detangler. Wash brush, my detangler. You gotta have the comb. You gotta have the comb. Let's put these to the sides and let's get into this heat. Let's get into this heat. All right. So me, I like to use the curve brushes, you know, either the curve brushes or the nine rolls, or sometimes I use my short boys. But right now I'm wolfing. Like I said, it's what, week seven of a 12 week wolf. So I still got a little time to go. So right now I'm into the heavy duty hard brushes. You smell me? Boom. This is my hard right here, my Torino Pro hard, super hard brush right here. This right here gets all the kinks out. That right there stretches out your waves tremendously, man, and gets you going. This is what I use to stretch it out, especially when I'm going through this long, long wolf session. This comes in handy right here. Next brush I got after that is the medium. I use this as well. This falls right into line with the uh, brush session. It's medium, Torino Pro. I love the curve uh, brushes because the curve brushes just like they fit your head. They just hug your head the right way, man. It's just, it's just ever since I started with the curve boys, I just couldn't go to any other brush. I mean, of course, I got my nine rolls, but I don't use them that often. Then I got a medium soft. Now this is a two-in-one right here, medium soft. Medium at the top, soft in the middle, medium at the bottom. Medium soft, because this is dominantly medium, and then you have the soft thatch in the medium. Wonderful brush, excellent. This is one of my everyday brushes as well. One of my everyday brush for my sessions. And then you got that amazing softy, that everyday brush. Now this right here, I use this every day, all day, every day. No matter what brush session I do, I always end with this softy right here, always. So this one gets beat up bad, but this is the brush right here. Amazing softy right here. The softy. Now let's get to these nine rolls. This is my nine roll hard. Right now, I'm currently using this nine roll hard during my wolf session. Extremely hard, I mean it gets to the roots, it pulls really well, it gets the job done, my baby. You smell me? My nine roll medium, super smooth. Like this right here, like the way this feels on your head it's real different, man. I mean, I love this brush. This brush feels amazing to your head. Amazing. This is my medium nine row. It's, it might be like a medium soft almost because it's not as hard, but it's, it's this is a nice brush right here. No cap. Nice brush. Let's get to that nine row softy, long bristles. I love this brush right here. I use this often as well during my sessions. Beautiful, amazing brush. Look how long those bristles are. Super small, super smooth, silky. Hey man, wondering what keep my waves intact, man. Is these brushes right here, no cap. 
Let's get into this right here. This is my little medium, my short boy. Now, during my wolf session that I'm currently in right now, this is coming big. This has been tremendous. I've used this all the time. I use this very often. It's been a big, big part of my wolf session right now, and it's amazing. Short curve boy hugs your head amazingly. Then we got that young crown brush. I use this predominantly for my crown when I need to use it. But as you can see, most of my brushes here, you know, they have the pointy tip already. So I kind of already use those for the crown. So I don't have to use this as much. But this is the crown brush, you know, and it's nice and it's a super firm hard. It might be like a medium hard, like a medium hard, but it's super, super legit. Get your crown together. This is what you can use. So if you're looking for a crown brush, this is a decent crown brush right here. This gets the job done for me. Also, you know, young Trino pros. You know. I should have actually started with this. It's the most important thing you need as a waiver. If you don't have a mirror, stop waving now. No cap. Blind brushing is just not it, man. You can't blind brush. Like, you really need to see what you're brushing, man, and get your connections right. Me, at this point, I got a lot of forks. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm trying to get rid of them. Blah, 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 whatever. But without this mirror, no chance. You stand no chance. Honestly, I'm about to give you the top secret. <laughs> the top secret to this wave joint right here, man. Ready for it? The plastic bag. Now, let me tell you something about the plastic bag. I slept on the plastic bag for months. For months, I chose, like, no, I'm not using that. I used to just brush my head with a softy, brush it down good, thinking I was brushing it down real good, and just smack the do rag on. Until I finally took it upon myself and said, well, you know what, let me, let me, let me try this plastic bag method. You know, I watch a lot of YouTube videos and a lot of guys on here talk about the plastic bag method. Let's test it out. Once I tested this plastic bag method out, uh, I haven't went back yet. Man, I got one in the house. I keep one everywhere. I got one in the car. The, look, this is the top secret right here, man. The plastic bag. If you're not, after you use your softy, after you use your softy, if you're not capitalizing it with this bag right here, get you a bag. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. Real talk. It takes your words to the next level. It takes it to the next level! I'm just being real. Fire. But there it is, man. These are the products I use. I showed you my products. I showed you the pomades, my shampoo. I showed you my oils. I showed you the moisturizers. I showed you my brushes, my baby. I got brushes on deck. Man, look, look, look. Thank you guys for staying tuned for this long ride with me, man. Look, man. <sighs> what I said, seven weeks right now. I got 12 weeks to go. Well, not 12 weeks to go, but I'm at seven weeks of my 12 weeks. But you get the drift. Keep following me, man. I'm gonna show you where I'm at with the waves, man. I cut my dreads, man. 17 years of having dreads and I cut it. Hey, you know what it is. Hey, thanks for joining the video. Let's get it. Hey, hit that like button. I need you to subscribe. Cause you know the vibes. Say less. No grind. No. Times are different now that I am older. Care about life now, so no more looking over shoulders. My heart is cold. I